Hey, I'm Albert from Muffin Group and from now on I will be making a video tutorials about the Bee Theme and the Bee Builder. If you have any feedback about this video or just want me to make a tutorial about something you don't know how to use, feel free to leave me a comment and I will do my best to help you. Ok, so let's move on to the topic. Today I will take a closer look at the column text editor option found in the settings tab of the Bee Builder. This option indicates which editor we will use when editing the content in the column element. We have two options here that we can switch between, code and visual. Code is a simple text editor based on the code mirror. It is a great solution mainly dedicated to advanced users who like to work with pure HTML or shortcuts. Because this editor is based on code mirror, your code syntax will be colored for better readability. This editor allows you to use any content inside, including tags like SVGs, iframes and other. Let's switch to the visual option now. As the important info says, a page reload is required, so I'm gonna to reload this page right now. After switching to this option, any column element will use visual editor based on TinyMCE. It is a typical WYSIWYG editor, thanks to which you can easily style the content inside, like set paragraphs, make the content bold, italic, underline text, use lists, insert media links and much more. Its use does not require any technical knowledge and is a great solution for both beginners and advanced users. However, it should be remembered that this editor, unlike code, has its own limitations such as inability to use tags like mentioned previously, SVGs, iframes and other. This option is global and will be used for the BB builder for the column element. I hope that in this short video, in a simple and accessible way, I introduced you to the differences between the code and visual options. The choice, however, I leave to you, because I am aware of how your work styles differ. That is all for this video. Thanks for watching and remember to like, subscribe and click the bell icon to get notified every time we release a new video. If you have more questions, please visit our support center at support.muffingroup.com.